Right then, okay, it's Kraken here. We are going to talk about the English Heavisaurus. Now, it's one of my most popular videos at the minute. It's my Heavisaurus songs in English. It has just over 12,000 views. And one of the questions I keep getting is, where's the English band? And I honestly don't know. It's really hard to say, you know, whether the English version of the band exists or not. Now, from information that I have sourced, there was actually supposed to be an English band sometime last year, but nothing's happened to that lately, and as you can tell this is mostly unscripted, and the most recent thing I could find that actually kind of shows that there may be an English band is the fact that the German band now exists, and I found information on Trademarks that was only compiled just recently. They only got the approval for the name Heavy Saurus in March, and so it's like, okay, are they trying the waters out with the German band first and then branching out to the English market? Or are they just sitting with the German band and I've only just seen the German band's trademark? It's one of the more interesting things about being a fan of this band. It's like, there seems to be all these different iterations. There's Heavisaurus, Heavisaurus, and Heavisaurus. Now, the name Heavisaurus, that's H-E-V-I, Saurus, is, you know, that was used for the Finnish, the Swedish, and the Hungarian bands. Heavy Saurus is just for the Argentinian lot, although that could easily just be the Spanish version as well. And now Heavy Saurus, whilst used for the German band, could easily be used for the UK and USA versions of the band. If they do two separate versions, I think they'll just do one version. One thing I would kind of like to see is just is there some sign of this actually happening? Because all I can find is just little bits and pieces of tiny bits of information that says that they've been trying to do this. Some of the biggest evidence is actually from the Heavy Saurus app, in which well, that's where I got those English songs from. They're all in the app. You know, with English voices and everything, even though they got the names completely wrong. So, you know, this has easily been something that they've been looking at you know, for a few years now, but we just haven't heard anything. So, maybe in the coming months we might hear more and more of an English version of the band, or what I personally think is happening that they're probably seeing how the German Heavy Saurus is received, and then they might branch out into the you know, English speaking version later. It's kind of hard to tell because information on this is so hard to find. I do regular searches in different name combinations just to try and get any sort of information out and I'm lucky to find an industry flyer I found the trademark information and the the website heavysaurus.com that's heavy as in this is really heavy not h-e-v-i is registered to Sony it's just not used yet it's just a placeholder website so the question that I get is when is there going to be an English Heavysaurus the short answer is I don't know but Everything seems to point that they're trying and they, we might see them soon, but until then, only time will tell. So, until then, and A Brief History of Heavy Saurus Part 6 is coming out, I promise. I'm just waiting on a very special guest to do some lines from me. So, until then, this is Kraken, signing out.